All right, let's crank up the speed. Here's the evolution of steam engines in just two minutes. First off, the very first steam-powered machine was basically a spinning toy, hero of Alexandria's Eolipile from the first century. Fast forward to 1698, Thomas Savory invents a steam pump to draw water out of mines. It worked, but had no moving pistons. Enter Thomas Newcomen in 1712. He combined steam with a piston and cylinder, creating the first atmospheric engine, a reliable workhorse for coal mining. But here's where it gets wild. James Watt, 1769. He adds a separate condenser. Boom. Suddenly, steam engines are way more efficient. They can power all sorts of machines, not just pumps. And with rotary motion, they're running textile mills, trains, and factories, powering the Industrial Revolution. Now let's talk about how these things actually work. You heat water in a boiler, turning it into high-pressure steam. That steam pushes a piston back and forth or in a turbine, it spins a shaft with angled blades. Once the steam's done its job, it gets cooled back into water in a condenser, then pumped back to the boiler to start again. This whole loop, that's the Rankine cycle. Today, steam turbines run almost every big power plant on Earth. Yep, even most nuclear plants use steam to generate electricity. Same with coal plants and natural gas plants. Even renewable energy sources like solar thermal and geothermal often rely on steam turbines. Steam engines aren't driving trains anymore, but they're still powering the world. And while internal combustion took over most transportation, steam still powers nuclear ships and submarines. The technology keeps evolving. Today's combined cycle plants can achieve over 60% efficiency, and new designs integrate carbon capture for cleaner power. From an ancient toy to a global power source, steam turbines generate over 80% of the world's electricity, running 24 7 to keep the lights on. From Newcomen's first engine to today's giants, steam technology is still powering civilization, and that's steam engines in a heartbeat.